Hey y'all, it's Angeline here. I'm gonna get my outfits and my hair and my makeup ready for the week because you know what? Even though I'm hugely pregnant, there are still so many things I can do to feel good about myself, you know? I'm in that stage right now where I'm just like, ugh, when is this baby coming? But anyway, a little bit of makeup on my eyes, my hair done pretty, and like, you know, of course, I want to impress my man and my friends, but mostly this is for me because, you know, a girl's got to do what a girl's got to do, and I never let that ball drop, you know what I mean? I just don't, because as soon as it drops, next thing you know, you're looking like one of your sisters. Anyway, I'm going to take some calls today because, you know, a lot of people have shown a lot of interest in my, you know, podcast, and I was thinking, why not let them be a part of it? Just, you know, throw me some questions that I wouldn't think to answer on my own. So I'm going to take this first call. Hello, you're on the air with Angeline. Hello, this is Ted Elux Delarosa. Oh, hi. Hello, I have a question for you. It's a two-parter. Do you have any pets? And if so, or if not, are you interested in a kitten? I will take my answer out the air. Oh, all right. Well, that was fast and efficient. All right, let me think here. First off, I do have a dog. His name is Cloud, and he is just the cutest little breath of spring you've ever seen. He's a big white, some sort of poodle mix, and he wears the cutest little blue collar most of the time, but sometimes we put him in a little sweater if it's cold out or he just got a haircut or something. And well, you know, I love cats. I really do. Don't get me wrong, but... I'm not ready for that kind of commitment, you know. One thing I know about cats is that you invite them into your house and the next thing you know, they're tearing up your furniture. Well, at least that's what I hear from my, well, my sister never says it, but I've gone to her house and her furniture's torn up in some places, you know. Some people say that dogs will do that. Oh, that lipstick looks so good, but I need a little something else. Some people will say that, you know, dogs will tear stuff up and chew it, but Ronan trained my dog so well that I'll never have that problem. I really don't. Anyway, I hope that answered your question, sweetheart. And uh, feel free to call back if you want to or whatever. Just, you know, thank you for the offer of the kitten. I know they're precious, you know. Anyway, I'm going to take another call. Um, hello, you're on the air with Angeline. Hi, this is Grace. Oh, hi, Grace. I hope I'm not interrupting nothing, but, you know, I'm calling him with a question here, and I just want to know, why weren't you out at the good church of the slower down uh, Sunday there? Oh, my goodness, Grace. Grace is Lottie's sister, y'all. Grace, I was not at the good church of the Lord on Sunday because, um... Well, I wanted to, and I planned on it, but things got a little romantic with my husband, and I, well, you don't need to know the details of that, but basically, let's just say, we spent the day in bed, pretty much, you know. My mama and my daddy had come by the night before and picked up my kids, and I guess it was just like, you know cheese and crackers, the fireplace roaring, reading to each other from a book of poetry, everything you could ever imagine nice and lovely, you know. And, you know, we slept in through it, I guess, so. Hey, y'all, in case you didn't know, Grace is the prominent exorcist in our town, and she is very involved with the good church of this Lord. I think I already mentioned that she's Lottie's sister, didn't I? She's just the sweetest sweetheart you've ever met. Well, thank you. That means so much to me. And, you know, I'm not calling for no judgment or nothing. I was just curious, but I love you, so I'll let you go. All right. Thank you. You see how sweet and golden her heart is? I mean, it just kills me. But anyway, Grace is one of my favorite of all of our sisters. And anyway, I just wanted to say, thanks for checking up on me. You know, anything could have happened. I'm always usually at the good church of this Lord. So, 
I just wanted everyone to know that. All right, I'm gonna take another call. You're on the air with Angeline. Oh, uh, hey, this is Hugo. Oh, hey, Hugo, what's you up? You Glamourland's father. Yeah, I know. Uh, I'm coming here to pick up Glamourland and Lottie's house and no one's answering the door, so do you know where she is? Um, you know what? I do not know, but if I hear from her, I will let her know that you were looking for her. All right. So, um, do you want to ask me a question or anything besides that? Not really, thank you. Bye. Holy heck, he's rude. Anyway, I just wanted to um, try out some different... You know, I was thinking, what would I look like with black hair? But then I was like, bad. Like, real pale. Anyway, um, I like to put my hair up sometimes, get it off my shoulders. Hey, we've got another call coming in. Hello, you're on the air with Angeline. Carl! Hey! Uh, is he go off my doorstep yet? Oh, I, you know what? I'll peek out the window. Hold on a second. Oh my goodness. You know what? Uh, I think his car is gone. I'm pretty sure I don't see him. Nope. He's going around the back. Girl, back? Yeah, shh, girl. He's going around the back. I'll just keep an eye on it. So what are you doing? Well, I'm doing my hair and my makeup right now, and I'm finding the cutest outfits. No, and they're fitting over my bump and everything. I'm having the best get ready with me day I've ever had in my life. Honestly. Get ready with me day. Oh, yeah, I'm recording. Oh, my. You're recording? Girl, I'm on the air right now live. I'm so sorry. Well, I'm at the market. I am, you know, taking Chloe and shopping for some clothes. I oh, go. you're such a good mother. <laughs> Bye, girl. Bye. Oh my gosh, she is such a good mother. You know what I mean? She takes Clarolene clothes shopping like as much as I go clothes shopping for myself. Oh my gosh, I'm loving this pink hat. And I'm going to do a little bit of a frosty look on my eyes. Maybe like, you know, a subtle lip or... No, you know what? I'm going bright and heavy on this one. Because I am going to show up at the door. And I am going to make everyone... Oh my gosh, Y'all, did you see these earrings? They're so cute. That's what makes this outfit wintry, you know what I mean? Now, normally I don't dress so broadly, but, like, I look so good. Sometimes you need that brightness to, like, spice up your life, you know what I mean? I'm kind of, like, in a rut, you know, to be perfectly honest. I've been wearing the same pale white and silvery colors for, like, a year now. Anyway, what an adventurous day we've had today, you know? I've tried out some new looks. I've done some different things with my hair. I've, you know, experimented, which is real important when you're trying to figure out what you want to look like for your week. But thanks for watching and thanks for calling in.